well. Joyner goes up the hill that time and been running the bottom. Now trying to go up the racetrack. Laps continue to wind down. Two laps remaining. Three car battle for second. Joyner, Henderson, Harrington. That's a points battle there. Magnolia Motor Speedway in Columbus, Mississippi for round two of the Hunt the Front Super Dirt Series. It is the Governor's Cup, the 20th annual Governor's Cup, 10,000 to win, super late models tonight, 45 of them signed in. This was going to be a doubleheader weekend at Magnolia. We lost night one though. It rained yesterday, Friday afternoon, right about the time we were getting ready to, to get here, get unloaded and get started. It rained pretty hard and Johnny Stokes Dr. Dirt, they call him. The promoter here at Magnolia has worked all day. Sun's been out all day, but he's been working all day to get the track ready to go for tonight. But I'm pretty sure it's going to have some character in it from that rain they got. Rain they got earlier in the week and then the rain we got yesterday. By the way, after the rain yesterday, we decided this morning to pull out the older car. It's got the Dell engine in it. A little bit bigger motor. Bigger we're going to need it on a hooked up racetrack tonight. say what you want tonight. Ooh, that's a good point. Good good point there, Joseph. Check out on Patreon, patreon.com slash at the front. We did a mic'd up uh, two-part video that is available over there on Patreon from Why Not last week. Did you fellas enjoy that? That was yeah. cool to go It was bad A. <laughs> <laughs> so check that out on Patreon. Tonight, though, we ready to go? Tonight, though. But we need to be tuned up, come on. You know, instead of mic'd up. Oh, I didn't. I didn't. I Come didn't, on, I didn't, I didn't follow. You know, instead of mic'd up tonight, we need to be tuned up. We need to up. be tuned up. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then he walks off. That was his chance to say, "Yeah, we are ready." Yeah, are we ready? We need to be tuned up. <laughs> right, forget, forget it. Well, we're, it's about time to hot lap, so if we're gonna tune up. We need to be doing it. Hey, we swapped whole. We swapped our whole car. All right. I think. I think that's probably a good call. Don't have tracks gonna have some character, all that rain yesterday. So it's easy, you know, on our a little bit older stuff. Bigger motor. Bigger motor. Last time we ran this car was in Mississippi, down at Why Not, a little over a month ago. Joseph won at Why Not State Series race. He also had won the night before at Buckshot. So this car, Foghorn with the Dell engine, is coming off of two wins its last two times at the track. Up to you. Can't drive before you can be just like all day. Hey, let's do like the first 20 laps of all day. But then go ahead and carry on for the next 30. Keep on leading while you're out there. Go ahead. Let's leave here with the with the you with the who you know what sponsor uh point series spoiler. But we have a spoiler? No. Oh. Then we have a spoiler. You know what I'm saying? We'll get, yeah, I'm all right. we'll break out that orange spray paint. Yeah. We'll start the the points leader spoiler That's for right. the series. That's you right. could leave here lead. I mean, I'm just speaking hypothetically. Yeah, if it's a good night, you can leave here leave, leading the Hunt the Front Super Dirt Series and the Mississippi State Series. Co-sanctioned race tonight. So, Which tour are we going to go with? <laughs> I don't know. I don't think we got to make a decision for a little while okay. on That's that. How good.
coming out of a kill mark. Out of the, the, the 43 that I like got. Be but I don't know that we ever really got a clear lap. Twist of the five cars. Rough. They're on the speedway now. For yeah. They're qualifying <laughs> in hot lap. It's going to be, uh, going to be a long night. To it. Yeah. Front to front, super late model cars, group one. Hey, you need to start qualifying. putting your cars in Quick stages turn around. One more time. Or you're qualified. So that's our first group of the first. All right, we'll be qualifying in just a second. That'll decide where we start a heat race. Qualify heat race, hopefully avoid a B-Main. 50 lap in the top of the Changing all four tires to qualifying. Looks like we're making an adjustment to change right here on the left rear. Shock and spring. Four, they'll send Terry Wilson. Oh, smirk man. Absolutely, the Langenfelder Mechanicals Contractors, Base Race Fuel, Trading Paint, Randy Clary Race Engine, Longhorn Chassis out of Milton, Florida. It is the 10 car of Joseph Joyner, Hunt the Front, sponsored 10 car. Also on the racetrack in car F1, out of Commerce, Georgia, in the Freeman Plumbing, Shelton Trucking, Coltman Farms Racing, Keith Freeman on Rock, or sorry, Capital, Cornette Powered Entry. The F1 is Peyton Freeman, the 21 Southern All-Star Series Champion, and the 2018 Southern All-Star Series Champion, Jay Scott from Fayetteville, Tennessee, in car 27. Scott goes ninth quick. Let's see what Freeman did. Seventh quick on lap number one. As Joyner. Fifth fastest for Joyner. That's a good lap there. Freeman. Held firm at seventh fastest. All right, I think we are fifth. I believe we're fifth out of 22 in a group. Should have started at a transfer spot in the heat. Or something like that. All three groups. All Everyone's doing that off the road. Everyone is shooting to the wall. They're on. Race track here. You're not the only one. One and two, you were cooking around. Oh man, this is a good lap. Three and four, it didn't bounce just right. Well, at know? first I'm like, all right, you know what? You split, I'm like, we're good, just come off the corner. And then the like, next thing you know, you hooked a ride. I'm like, oh, no. We're coming up next. Hey, it's not bad, man. Should be starting third. The fastest to go out late. Yeah. We should, we should be starting third in the heat taking four. You know, Ross, you talk about the sponsors of a racetrack. We're going to find out here in just a minute. We are as the twins. Big bodies and the farts and follow the leader any day. So I guess we have got the buckle AC belt. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. I like his attitude. That's the pit crew. That is the pit crew. That should help, guys, a little more ground clearance for the hose, for the ripples. Yeah. 
track bank heat races for the Hunt the Front Super Dirt Series. Harrington and Clem, row one, Joiner and Sebers. Row number two, I don't see Dacus on the racetrack. I know he had some problems, may have elected to scratch from tonight's event. Heat race number three is green. Will Harrington, the race leader, leads to turn one. Tyler Clem's going to try to battle on the outside. He's got to run. Best we've seen anybody get through turn two on the outside all night. He thought about going to the inside of, of Harrington, thought better of it. Harrington leads lap number one over Clem. Joiner, Mills, and now Siebers, your top five. side. Looks like we're going to get the checkered flag this time and it's going to go to the Hawkinsville Hustler, Will Harrington. Will Harrington, your race winner here in heat race number three. Tyler Clem second, Joseph Joyner third, Ryan Crane in the fourth position, final transfer spot, and Johnny Scott. There is your lineup. Oh, 
Harrington with his car in tenth. New points leader Will Harrington is second, third in points. Peyton Freeman is eighth. Joseph second in points. Need to get up there with those guys, get ahead of them. It says a 50 lap feature, but they just said they cut it to 30 laps. So 30 laps, 10,000 to win, start in tenth. Both starting right behind us in 11. Could be an interesting one. It's going to be interesting. go ladies and gentlemen the hunt the front super dirt series governor's cup at magnolia is green it's time to hunt the front and they go down in turn number one here comes harrington in that 19 car he'll have the lead down the back straightaway that's john henderson falling falling to second shane clanton moves into the second position now put henderson back to third henderson tried to middle there in one and three and four and he did not like it here comes Josh Putnam. Boy, this is a lightning quick Magnolia Motor Speedway. Definitely not used to seeing this here as these guys are making a blistering pace. Neil Baggett with problems, oh. top of turn four. Turn three and four for the restart. He's got the front, and he's going to try to keep it. Green flag is in the air. We are back underway with J.R. Mosley trying to stick in the top three. Whoa, up the racetrack he goes. Peyton Freeman able to get around. Now Peyton Freeman goes to work on John Henderson down the back straightaway. Freeman comes into contact with Henderson, has to slow up. That opens the door for Joseph Joyner. Joyner now in the third position, battle for the lead in turn two. Up the racetrack with Harrington. Putnam is there. They are door-to-door -door in turn three. Putnam slides up the racetrack in front of Harrington. New race leader is Josh Putnam off of turn four. Yellow flag is out. The yellow lights are on at the top of turn number two. I don't know if we got the lap scored. Green flag is back in the air. Will Harrington leads the field down. Let's see what happens on row number two. Putnam with the early advantage. He's going to take the lead off of turn two. Harrington went up the racetrack, and now Putnam's your race leader. He made the pass last time. He didn't make it stick. But go. Oh, we got him stacking up in turn three. Wow. Caution flag is out. Josh Putnam has to be thinking, you have got, got to, to be, be kidding, kidding me. <laughs> single file restarts. Looks like we've made the decision to stay single file. Green flag is in the air. Harrington, Putnam, Joyner, Henderson, Freeman, your top five. Freeman going to go to the top shelf, see if he can get a run. Oh, on the right side was, was John Henderson. I saw the undercarriage of that car as we've got a battle for second shaping up. Joyner peeking under the 212 of Putnam. Watching down here, Travis Biden. Putnam bicycled it there a while ago, but he's a little bit better through turn one and two that time. Oh, Jason Garver goes around mm. turn two. Caution flag is going to fly. Yet another restart here. Harrington, see if he can get a better restart. Putnam's going to try to finally make a pass stick if he can be aided by uh, staying on a green flag run here. Green flag is back out in the middle. Gets shaken up yet again. So does Putnam. Joiner. Sticks the nose under, but can't make it stick. He'll go to the bottom, Putnam to the outside in three and four. Putnam comes down the hill, cuts off the momentum. That has to cause Joyner to check up. He does so, and now contact with Peyton Freeman, who stuck it in on the bottom side there, coming off of turn number four. Move Peyton Freeman in the third. He's not done. He won't second. He's going to look under Putnam. Oh, they made contact. He had to get on the binders. Everybody kept it straight. And Will Harrington still showing the way after lap number six has been scored. We're making these guys search to try to find a run. You can have a really good run in one spot on one lap, and then the next time you come through, if you hit the ruts a little a little different, you can uh, have a, a, a really bad run coming off or going in the corner. So these guys are all over the place. Freeman was uh, on fire there for a few yeah. seconds as Harrington leads. Yep, it's coming, and I'll tell you something else here in the next few laps. If we stay green, lap traffic but we got caution again on the speedway. At the top of the racetrack, maybe somewhere. I see officials headed toward the racetrack, but I'm not quite certain. And the question is, can they last? Right, can, can they, they survive? Last? It's a matter of survival. The guys that have already come in and changed tires, maybe the ones that are kind of hanging back just to see how this unfolds. Battle for second off Joyner. of two. Joyner takes the second spot from Putnam. Putnam going to go back to work. Oh. Woo, he bicycled. I thought for a second there he might have been uh, in store for a wild ride. Putnam going to go back to work trying to close in on Joyner. Looks underneath. Joyner up the racetrack. They're door-to-door -door off of two. Putnam takes the second spot back. Those two having a really good race um, amongst themselves. Will Harrington's liking to see it because he's trying to extend his race lead, which is now 1.1 seconds back. 
Putnam from Harrington. A fourth place run thus far. Ryan Crane right there in fifth. He's doing battle with awesome. John Henderson, and the yellow flag is out as the race leader. Will Harrington with problems at the bottom of turn number two. Oh, my goodness. All right, here's our replay from earlier. So Harrington gets in there. And he's, oh, he just he hit the berm, berm on the bottom with the nose. Man. Nose and roll through three and four. Lights are out. And we are back on the way. 13 laps complete. Josh Putnam brings the field to life. Joseph Joyner, you know, there may only be a handful of cars left on the racetrack, but these guys up front, all they see is $10,000. $10,000 in their eyes. Watch that 19. He's trying to move and shake his way back toward the front as well. Here he comes. Yeah, if these guys can figure out a way to get uh, through three and four on the outside a little bit better, we might have some movers and shakers on the top. Harrington is slicing through the field. Freeman goes around Henderson, moves up in front of him. That's a battle for the fifth position now. So he'll go on the outside around Ryan Crane. That right rear may actually be helping him. Is he? Whoa! Oh! Up and over. Freeman, wouldn't it? The F1 car of Peyton Freeman. My goodness, what a violent flip in turn one. Out of the car, thankfully, helmet is off. Man, oh man. Hopefully we've seen our last of the caution flags and the green flag is back in the air. Back on the way. Way with some problems getting through one and two. On the top side goes Henderson. Here comes Joyner for the race lead. Peaked under Putnam. Putnam saw he was there. Steps on the gas. Pulls away off of turn four. Back to turn one and two they go. Putnam on the bottom. So is Joyner. He passed both way on the last lap. He's going to try to get Joyner this time. As we roll off of turn number four, I believe it'll be 19 laps complete that time there. Scoring computer was froze just a second. A little refreshing. Yes, 19 complete. Henderson goes to second. John Henderson is on the move. The Warrior Comanche moves to the outside of Joseph Joyner. Hunt the front's on the bottom. Henderson's on the outside, and now Henderson's going to hunt the front down the front straightaway. He's got Josh Putnam about half a track or half a straightaway ahead. That's 2.3 seconds ahead. It's a long way to go, but a short time to get there. As we're less than five laps now, four laps remaining. Henderson with problems, opens the door back for Joyner. Joyner and Henderson side by side for second. Josh Putnam just wants to see it stay green and he wants to ride. As he works up through turn three and four, he will see three laps remaining. They are door to door still for second. Door to door for second. That's gonna allow Harrington to close the gap as well. Joyner goes up the hill that time and then running the bottom. Now trying to go up the racetrack. Laps continue to wind down. Two laps remaining. Three-car battle for second. Joyner, Henderson, Harrington. That's a points battle there. Putnam leads down the back straightaway. We'll stay locked on your second-place battle. Putnam works out of four. White flag is going to be in the air this time by. Joyner is second. Third is John Henderson. Fourth is Will Harrington with a lot of nose damage on that car. Bo Slay with problems there coming off of turn four. We'll stay green. Down the back straightaway through turn three and four for the final time. Josh. He's from Florence, Alabama. He's hunt the front and found it at Magnolia. Your race winner of the Governor's Cup is Josh Putnam in the 212. Joseph Joyner finishes second. Third is John Henderson. Fourth is Will Harrington. Well, <laughs> how's your neck? <laughs> Golly. Congrats to Josh Putnam. Your winner. Tear off, Mark. We do 30 tear offs, yeah. tear off a lap. I hear you. This time, like 25 miles. 25.70. <laughs> <laughs> Either way, 23.25. 25.70. Yeah. So. Man, you make it or you make it through? <laughs> <laughs> Jesse, you, you driving. <laughs> Y'all could. Yeah. I was going to say you could drive home tomorrow, but tomorrow's Mother's Day. I could go. I could be all right. Yeah. If, they, if, it, right. if it just wasn't tight, I could. I bounce where I wanted to bounce when I bounce. You know what I mean? Yeah, like, then it'd push. Yeah. But I could <laughs> never. <laughs> thank you, buddy. Jordan, man. I thought you, uh, thought you were going to stick by there a few times. Yeah, we, uh, we were okay there. I think we got by Josh one time, but as soon as I got out in front of him and got behind Harry, and then I bounced wrong one good time, and he come back by. So. Thank you guys for watching and uh, being here. Uh, 
we, we couldn't be here without y'all's support. So, uh, but we just, you know, we're, we're, we're happy with it to run second here uh, to get through this thing with, I don't think we got anything tore up. So we're happy for that. And I uh, just thank everybody that uh, helps us on this thing. Uh, Langenfelder Mechanical Contractors, Base Racing Fuel, uh, Trade and Paints, uh, all our great uh, product sponsors that, that help us get up and down the road and supply parts for these things. Uh, we couldn't do it without, a, without them. Uh, uh, everybody here that helps turns wrenches, uh, Jesse and Jordan and Dusty and my dad, uh, Eddie, uh, Jonathan, uh, just everybody there, uh, you know, at the shop and here that uh, makes this thing go around. My wife at home and uh, taking care of the baby so I can be out here on the road doing what I do. So, and the man above for making it happen. Good call to get the, uh, the, the Foghorn Dale in. Oh, out ain't there. no <laughs> doubt. Did you imagine putting our new car through that? Uh, hey, series director, you glad that yeah, one's yeah, over? Congratulations. Good job. Mother's Day to late Mother's late Day Mother's to all you mothers out there and mine <laughs> and, and my child's mom. Good job. <laughs> anyway, that's going to do it from Magnolia Motor Speedway. Huge shout out to the staff here at the track. They did everything they could to give us a track we could race on. I know it's easy to say shoulda, woulda, coulda and all that stuff, but I guarantee you, I promise you, everyone here did everything they could to get the event in, to keep the track as as uh, raceable as possible and hats off to the whole both series the mississippi state series and the hunt the front super dirt series and their crew crews and the track we'll be back in action next week swainsboro raceway and sonora raceway a double header in georgia catch it live on hunt the front tv thank y'all for watching this video like comment subscribe we'll see y'all later